Welcome to this No IT video tutorial. Today we'll show you how you can manually install No IT onto an Android device. Now please note that we provide an automatic remote installation service where one of our technicians can perform a complete installation for you over the web. To find out more, click here. To get started with manual installation, log into your No IT administrator portal. Inside your No IT portal, there is an easy to follow step by step installation wizard to help you install No IT. To access the wizard, simply click the navigation bar in the top left corner. Click Tools, then click Install Device Software. In this video, we're installing No IT onto an Android device, so we'll click Android. iPhone and iPad installation, along with PC and Macs, are covered in separate videos. Certain No IT features may require that you have rooted the Android device before installing No IT. No IT can still be used if the device is not rooted. You simply won't get any additional root only features. If you want to root the device yourself, click the knowledge base link shown. Here you can find information about what rooting is and how to root the most common Android devices. For this video, we're using an already rooted Android device. Whether your Android device is rooted or not, click Next to continue. Here, you can see the URL to download No IT along with your activation code. You'll need your activation code later during the installation process to activate No IT. To begin installing No IT on the Android device, open up your preferred internet browser. Type in the URL shown inside the No IT portal to automatically start downloading No IT. Tap the completed download shown in the notification bar to start installing No IT. First, you must enable installation of unknown sources. To do this, click Settings. Make sure that the Unknown Sources option is checked. When it is checked, the following message will appear. Make sure that Allow This Installation Only is checked and tap OK. After you tap OK, the No IT installation will continue. Now keep clicking Next to progress through each page of the No IT Installation dialog. On the final screen, tap Install to start installing No IT. Google may ask you if you wish to check device activity for security problems, as shown here. If you see this notification, tap Decline. No IT will complete the installation process. Once this has been finished, tap Open. You must now disable notifications and re authentication inside SuperSU. To do this, tap Not Yet. Tap Open SuperSU. Tap Settings. Make sure re authentication and show notifications are not checked. Press the Back button on the device to exit SuperSU and then tap the No IT icon. We can now continue with the installation by tapping OK. Tap Begin Installation. No IT will now attempt to get root access on the device. Tap Next to start. Tap Grant before the timer reaches zero. No IT will now try to get root access. This can take some time. If full root permissions can be granted on the device, the software will run in full mode, giving you all the No IT root features. Simply tap Restart Now when asked. If you do not see that No IT is running in full mode, you may see instead that it is running in limited mode. In this case, you must tap Use Limited to continue. What this means is that No IT can still be used. You just won't get certain root features, and this is because of the Android device configuration. More information on this can be found in the No IT knowledge base. In full mode after the device restarts, in the main app drawer, Tap the No IT icon to proceed to activate No IT. Inside your No IT Administrator portal, you'll see your license code, which was shown earlier. Type in your license code and then tap Activate to activate No IT. Activation of No IT may take some time. Once activation is complete, tap Yes to keep the No IT icon visible or tap No to hide it. This option must be set in accordance with your company policy. Inside the No IT Administrator portal, click Finish to conclude installing No IT. In order to verify that No IT is now working on the device, let's take a look at the device dashboard. To do this, we click the navigation bar in the top left corner. 
we then click All Devices. In the All Devices menu are Android devices listed. Right-click the Action button and click View Device Dashboard. Here you can see the device dashboard of our Android device with no IT installed and data is already being captured and uploaded. This concludes the No IT Getting Started tutorial. In this video, you've learned how to install No IT onto a rooted or unrooted Android device, that No IT can run in limited or full mode on a rooted Android device depending on the configuration, and finally, that No IT has an installation service that you can use which takes care of rooting an Android device and installing No IT for you. If you found this video useful, we would be delighted if you could let us know by clicking the like button. If you have any suggestions as to how to make this video better, please send us your comment by clicking here.